Hey, what's up, everyone? Uh, Sifu Angelo Ferrer here, uh, MMA coach and Kajukenbo instructor. Coming out of Level Up Gym in Hyogo, Japan, representing Team Kajukenbo Japan. Kajukenbo Hyogo, Japan. Uh, today's question comes from Idris Abdullah. Idris asks, can you bite your way out of a rear naked choke? Hmm. I want to say... See, there's no absolutes in martial arts, and I want to make that very clear. I'm not going to tell you that there's no way that you can bite your way out of a rear naked choke. But I am going to say that it's highly unlikely. And the reason I'm going to say that is because a rear naked choke comes around right here with the goal to get your chin up and then start choking you, like this. Chances are, if the choke is deep, you're not going to be able to get your chin under because that's how you actually escape the rear naked choke. That's part of the escape is you try to get your chin lined up to the elbow pivoting point right here to try to start getting out of here. Maybe you could open your mouth at this point. But if you do get that far, if it's not that deep, for some reason you got your chin here, you still want to keep your chin tight because if your chin is loose, the guy can crank your jaw and dislocate your jaw. Most likely, if you try to bite at that point, you will get your jaw dislocated. There's some variables, pain tolerance and experience. How experienced is the person trying to choke you out? That kind of stuff. But most likely, my answer is going to be no. You're either going to get choked out because your chin, if the guy got it good, you're not going to get your chin. You're not even going to be able to get your mouth to the arm to bite it if he did a good job of, or he or she did a good job of getting it right under your chin. And even if they did get it over your chin, you're probably going to get your, your jaw dislocated, like I mentioned. But you never know. You, maybe, but I, I seriously doubt it. Well, this has been Q&A with the Coach. Don't forget to train your mind and body and spirit every day. And I'll catch you all next week for the next question.